This is the Husqvarna Viking Amber Air S400. This is a four thread machine, but this is an air thread. So it is extremely easy to thread. Um, what we'll do is we'll open this up and we'll take a look. So all of the mechanism down here is controlled by this little lever. So you're gonna put your thread in, flip the lever, and it shoots out the side. I'm gonna go ahead and show you. So I've got most of the, the machine threaded. Now for those of you that have, have never owned a serger, uh, this is great because you'll never have to worry about threading order. You can do whatever you want. But for those of us that have had a serger in the past, we all know that threading order is important. And the first thing to get threaded is that upper looper. Well, with this one, I can thread in any order I like. So I'm gonna thread the upper looper last. So I'm gonna come on over and tuck it into that pretension, bring it down into my tensions. And then down here is where I can get it set up for threading. So right now I'm set into serger mode, or to sew the stitch mode, I'm gonna set it over to the threading. There are little tubes that will line up in here, and I'll just turn my hand wheel until those tubes lock into place. You'll know it when it happens. And then I will just tell it what side I'm gonna be threading. So I'm gonna be threading this looper. So I turned it to this side, and I'm just gonna tuck it right into that little hole there. And it's going to shoot out of this looper up here. So, so if I lift the lever and give it a, did you see it? Waha, there it is, all threaded and ready to go. I'm gonna tuck it on behind. Okay, then we can go ahead and close this up. So it is a really, really nice serger. It does a two thread, three thread, four thread. I'm gonna go ahead and do a little stitch right now. Um, and one of the nice things is sergers are really designed for efficiency. So we really only need the foot up for threading to open up the tensions while we're threading. Otherwise, we can leave the foot down because everything up here in the front is spring loaded. So you just lift up the front and shove the fabric in. And once you have your fabric in, you're just gonna give it some gas. And there is a cutter up here on the side. And this is a little different than a sewing machine. So a sewing machine, you would cut the thread. With a serger, we need to let it chain a little bit and leave a little bit of a tail going on. But look how beautiful, look how beautiful those stitches are. Mm -hmm. We also have uh, the pretension here. So in the instructions, you will get a list of all the stitches that are available that it can do and so when you say i want to do like a two thread rolled hem um, it'll have a little checklist and it'll tell you you're going to set your tensions to this you're going to change your presser foot to this you're going to change your stitch length um, it'll tell you how to set everything up and it'll let you know whether you're going to be using a pretension of normal or tight. But that is what this is. This is just a little pretension. It's a little extra feature um, to get the best results that are possible. So there's a little accessory tray that comes with this, and you're going to get all kinds of um, you know, screwdrivers for your needles and a little tray for this little bit that falls off into there. Or the Amber Air S400 also has a needle threader, which is very cool. So what is cool about it is there's only two needles in this, so you can move the needle to, the, to thread the left needle or the right needle just by making a little adjustment right there. And you just pull that down, throw your thread in, and pull that back up, pulls right through. So it is really, really an amazing, amazing little serger. Uh, a lot of bang for the buck. This is the Husqvarna Viking Amber Air S400.